All right, let's get started. How did physicians in this hospital try to end humanity over the weekend? An emergency physician started Vank and Zosin for a fever of unknown origin. <sighs> Team, what will it say on my tombstone after I die? Not, Not all, all fevers, fevers are, are from, from an infection. infection. And what will it say on everyone else's tombstone when a megabacteria rips through half the population in a matter of weeks? We, we should, should have, have taken, taken antibiotic, antibiotic stewardship more seriously. seriously. You're damn right. What else we got? A hospital has started meropenem without ordering blood cultures first. All right, put him in infectious disease jail for six weeks. What else? Psst. What's infectious disease jail? You're not allowed to copy-paste any part of ID's consult notes into your discharge summaries. You have to write it yourself. Oh my god. <sighs> Anybody get any interesting consults over the weekend? We saw a woman who grew up in the Ohio River Valley who now lives in an abandoned church belfry loaded with bats. That's not bad. Up on the third floor, there's an HVAC repairman who drinks raw goat milk and fosters armadillos. We're getting closer. Oh, I know. How about a fourth generation cheesemaker who lives in a small town famous for its artisanal beer? He just got home from a work trip to Cambodia where he drank a lot of river water. Bingo. Did you write a consult note? Yes, sir. It's a little light. Yeah, I know you said no less than two pounds, but I tried my best. How did you obtain the Cambodian Airlines flight manifest? I had to catfish somebody in the Department of Homeland Security. <laughs> I didn't start catfishing until fellowship. Strong work.